Hi everybody and welcome to another episode of Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. This is New Blood episode uh, number 34. And as you can see here, entrepreneur level, I need a park rating of over 400, which I've got uh, 643 right now. But I gotta maintain that for at least two months. And I gotta repay my loan, which right now I don't own too much, but uh, I'm probably gonna have to borrow some money to build up the park and keep things going. So. Uh, as you can see right there, uh, I got cash of uh, 4683 I got a loan of $5,000. i am going to burn some of that off right now because I need to uh, get that, work on getting that paid back. Now obviously, if you remember from this scenario, is that uh, I can't charge for rides. It's, it's entrance fee only and you know those are a little bit tougher because they're not paying per ride they're just paying to get in the park and then they're gonna ride the rides all day long so it doesn't matter how long my queue lines are at this point in time um, the main thing is, is that I want to get uh, people into the park so they pay that entrance fee and then the only other way I'm gonna subsidize anything is through my shops and stalls as you can see this park is not really that big overall it's um, a fairly small park so I have to be very uh, frugal with my space as to where I put the put down the rides and make it kind of compact and everything and see what we've got here plus I have to add more lights you know <laughs> you gotta have some lights so we're gonna add a spooky wheel that fits nicely right here in this little section of the park right there that little thin strip coming in so we're going to put that there because it'll it'll work just fine and people get a good view of it put my exit right there and then of course my entrance and then uh, got to add in a queue it's not a super popular ride so I don't really need a really big queue but it does have a fairly decent capacity so with the capacity of the ride itself plus the size of the queue, I think I'll be okay. I don't think I'll have any issues with, com with complaints about uh, wait times. Plus it, of course, it, it fits in the theme really well. So. That's another reason to have it. mechanic we definitely need as the park gets bigger you need more people to uh, fix rides and, and repair stalls so we're gonna do that the weather at this park is not that great it seems to rain a lot I think it's kind of a hint trying to tell me that hey you want to make some money uh, sell some umbrellas So we're going to take a look at some stalls here. I'm going to add a, uh, a safari hat stall. Now these stalls, they don't make a whole lot of money, but at least it sells a helmet and then it's got uh, uh, three different types of balloons that they also sell. So that's a, that, that's a good thing. At least it gives us uh, some variety for um, the keeps to uh, enjoy. I'm going to add a, a beanie hat uh, stall also. It might uh, prove to be popular with the kids. Try to keep a clean and uh, tidy park. I'm 
need to add just a few more uh, lamp posts just because it's uh, when it gets dark it just doesn't we don't want to keep the people in the dark went ahead and attached that uh, piece of uh, pathing there we go first aid station it's not not that I've got a roller coaster yet or anything like that but you should have one in there someplace in case people are feeling sick I'm going to up the entrance price just a little bit make some more money park ratings still good it's at 700 and we've achieved that uh, for two months park rating for 400 for two months we've achieved that so now we're halfway we're halfway through uh, the scenario there all we gotta do is figure out how to make some more money to pay back that loan <laughs> I do hope everyone is uh, enjoying the uh, um, the playthroughs that I'm doing. Uh, like I said, I'm I've never gone this far in the game, so that actually these scenarios that I'm playing here, I'm playing them for the first time when you're seeing them because I never got past the first four scenarios of the game, and that was way back when. If you take a look, and you now here we are. This is episode number 34. Yeah, so I've really got down there, and I've completed all the levels except on two. As you remember, I've got two scenarios in the early that I didn't uh, complete the tycoon level because it wasn't it wasn't quite giving it to me. I don't know what I was doing wrong, so I I will uh, I decided to push on and I'll I'll revisit those because I've got two bonus scenarios here coming up at the end that um, are um, only available if you've completed like all the tycoon level and all the entrepreneur level. So. So far, I've, I've done all the entrepreneur levels. I've got them, so I'm missing uh, two tycoon levels at this point. Not counting this one, assuming that I get it completed. So Here we are back at the entrance there. You know, I see a little bit of... Uh, well, there's a fair amount of uh, throw-up around here. Not that there's any throw rides to, uh, to make them sick. Maybe they got uh, sick on the spooky shakes. But... Uh, We'll put a, another staff member up here and let him uh, help uh, clean up this area because a, a good park is a happy park. A clean park is a happy park. Plus, it'll help uh, attract more uh, more visitors, which means more money. And this janitor basically just going to assign them the... Uh, Oh, my cash flow is down to negative numbers. With all the rain going on there. I'm, uh, I'm going to have to um, raise the price on my umbrellas, I think, is a logical step at this point because I mean, there's a lot of folks in here and they want to stay dry. Went down and I put a few benches in along the way there to 
make uh, people have a place to sit down. It's all good. Park rating is still way up there, although I've already met that part there, but the higher the rating, the more uh, people we're going to attract. So it's all good. Here comes the rain again. Boy, if it's going to this park, it's kind of hard to pick a day where the um, it's not going to rain. <laughs> Uh, we got some uh, vomit up here in this area. Hopefully the janitors will be by soon or I may end up having to uh, assign another janitor. I am uh, going to um, build a, a coaster. I need, to, I need to get a coaster into the park because that will help with the park rating and it will also get me some more uh, people to come in. So right now we're going to put it down on another janitor and uh, we're going to give him send him to college. And I'm going to assign him this back area here. See, I don't really have anybody assigned to this area yet. him up with that other area there from the front so um, I think I've got my janitors equally spaced now I believe I've got I believe I've got four of them in the park now so that all looks good everything seems to be going there my janitors cleaning up there and that's good that's nice I like that I like that park rating 733 going up just a little bit my ride up time is a plus 98 I like that right now uh, top spinner seems to be the uh, the main attraction everybody likes it so This long patch right here along the pathway there, that area looks prime for a, a skinny coaster. And then I've got this other wide area here. That could be an area for another uh, larger coaster. But I'm looking at putting in uh, Dizzy Mouse here because it, I know it uh, from past experience. I know it's long and skinny and it did... Uh, It'll actually fit into this area of the park, so that makes me uh, makes me very happy about that. We'll get that in here, up and running. Of course, you can't charge anything extra for it, but we can uh, get more people into the park. And then I just made a boo-boo. I gotta shorten the queue just a little bit because I gotta have an exit. That looks better. Put the maintenance schedule, boost it up. People are starting to queue up for it. I've only got one one train right now, one car. We'll have to uh, we'll have to change that. And we're going to change the name from Dizzy Mouse to Monster Mouth. Try to keep it more of a uh, the theme. A lot of people are heading this way. It's going to looks like it's going to be a, a big hit, a good attraction for the for the park. And a couple 
benches there because people are going to need to sit down, especially after they get off the ride. Yeah, a few more benches. Do have a little bit of cash going here. We'll have to start paying some of it back. I'm getting a fairly long queue here. I think I'm going to have to shut her down for a moment and add some more cars. There we go. So I had two more cars, so now we got uh, three cars. That should uh, work out a lot better. I definitely had to up my loan to uh, buy the roller coaster. So, um,. I'm going to pay some of that back with the excess that we've uh, had and hopefully uh, we can get the rest of this paid off and uh, win the scenario. But it looks a lot better now. I've got, uh, got one car loading, one that's coming in the station, one's on the track. I think that's balanced out pretty well. And this right now looks like this is my longest queue in the park, but it's all good. So we're going to uh, change up our research a little bit. We're going to drop how much we're paying in to the research to save some money because I need to apply that money towards the loan. And then uh, we're going to reduce uh, the things that, that we are researching and uh, we're going to increase uh, a couple of areas and uh, decrease some others. Now I've got the loan down to just 4000 I just paid off a bunch more of it. And we just have to see what how it goes. But look at it, my key, I like my queue. Too bad I can't get um, money for riders paying per ride. I would have already won this. <laughs> we we'll definitely make some money off that ride there. Got a pretty decent crowd now. We got 428 people in the park. We're in our third year of the park operating, so that, that's not too awful bad. Uh, cash wise, I've got about almost 600 bucks cash. Just need to get a few more people into the park, that's all. I'd like to um, maybe add another another ride. The Claw of Doom or the Phoenix Twister would be nice. Another big thrill ride. Uh, the dinosaur go around the ultimate kitty ride. <laughs>
But we are looking good. We got eight, almost 900 bucks. That percentage is really killing me there at uh, night, almost 20%. That, yeah, that, that, that's killing me. The rain coming up here, see if we can't pay off another thousand here really quick. few cents can really make you uh, make you some good money but there we go we got enough we paid it down now we're at 3,000 just uh, 3,000 to go gonna up the uh, price by three dollars to the entry fee do it gradually I had it up at 25 at one time when I first started this and then I didn't notice many people coming in so I lowered the price now as I've added some rides I'll just let the price trick up slowly and that'll get me more people into the park which will help pay for my uh, uh, pain off of my uh, debt so there we go I just up some prices on the the burger stand and we just up the price at the spooky shake Seeing a little bit of puke on the pathways there. My uh, janitors need to get a little more on the ball here, I think. Uh, my uh, park patronage seems to be going down. Looks like right now we're just barely at 400 people, just 407. Looks like uh, that's up to 412. So. Park range at 7:14. That's that's good. Not doing too bad overall on it. Uh, guess happiness seems to be uh, doing uh, doing pretty well. One thing I don't have is some trash bins. I'm going to add it, spend some money and add some trash bins. And just because keeping the trash off of the pathways adds to uh, the happiness factor and the cleanliness factor. We'll just add a few trash bins around the park. Looking good. That's enough for now, I think. Look at the line on my uh, coaster. It's doing pretty good. Got a steady flow. Here we go. Here's a nice aerial view of the park itself and how it's uh, shaped up so far. I got some more ideas of uh, where I'm going to put some other rides at when we uh, uh, continue to expand. Right now I'm on the quest to uh, complete the scenario by paying back my loan. And we're doing it as best we can. I still got 3000 still owe 3000 But as I pay it down, then uh, I get more money because the, uh, the interest rate stays the same but uh, less money I have or owe the less I'm going to be paying out in interest so we're 
almost up to another thousand bucks. There we go. Now we're down to two thousand. Only two thousand more dollars to go. I mean that's not, that's a lot of money. I don't know about you. It's a lot of money for me. But uh, two thousand bucks in this game doesn't usually take too awful long. I have been running it. If you hadn't noticed uh, on high speed, there's no reason for me not to. Um, at this point, like I said, I'm not going to uh, do anything uh, uh, more, add, add any more rides right now. Right now, I'm all about just manufacturing money through my uh, entrance fees and through my shops and then throwing down some, uh, you know, trash cans or any uh, benches, whatever, stuff like that. Uh, just a little stuff to make the, um, make the park... Uh, happiness rating stay up so people will stay in the park while they're in the park uh, they're spending money that's the main thing you're definitely spending money we'll go up the price of the beanie hat Price of my uh, sunglass stall there. We got to make some money. Now we're up seven hundred bucks right now. Working on that next thousand. Pay some bills, six hundred. Park entrance fees are starting to go up a little bit there. Uh, July wasn't too much. We had a down month there, but August we're looking at almost a thousand dollars in entrance fees. That's pretty darn good. And there we go, there's a thousand right there. Now we only got a thousand, a thousand more to go. We're working hard. And uh, my entrance fee is down 25 bucks. I have to buy like two bucks. of the way there we're just on about 250 right now 250 bucks so just a little bit more to go now, i hope everybody you know you are enjoying the, the series and please uh, don't forget like and subscribe so i can continue to keep doing more of this i, I like doing it and the fact that i'm playing games that i haven't played before is uh, all the more reason for me to keep on doing it so just don't forget to like and subscribe because i do appreciate it and i uh, appreciate everyone that uh, does watch and i hope to keep keep you going so thanks that's uh means a lot well now we've got uh, almost 650 bucks another 350 go here comes the rain i mean these <laughs> It's like an old horror movie. I don't know what's going on now. We're at five, almost six hundred still. Need to pay off that thousand bucks. Day, okay?
okay? Bye-bye.